Well, well, the vibe is warm. The vibe is getting hot. These economic powerhouses from around the world, all of them women, are uniting to encourage other women to join them in taking their businesses to the next level. The tendency with us women, we're very humble, we're very polite, you know, we stand back and then the men come and grab these opportunities. When there's an opportunity, you must be the first in the line. Bacana saber que aqui nesse meio nós temos aquelas mulheres que estão realizando seu sonho profissional. Get out there and offer your services proudly, but never forget that we excel when we have passion. So ladies, remember, never sell in desperation. Sell to people who want your products and services and who are going to pay for it. Keep going in the face of obstacles and advocating for policy and structural changes were key messages to the more than 500 women entrepreneurs at the opening of the Women Vendors Exhibition and Forum on 2nd September 2015 in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Women are the 50% or more of the population in many countries. But don't forget, we are the mothers of the rest. So we have the power, but we need now the action. By working on collecting data on women in coffee, sharing, learning, information, and business networking, helping women in coffee to organize themselves collectively. Nobody can be left behind. Many, many organizations doing important work, but they're not coordinated, they're not collaborating with each other, they haven't built the partnerships that can transform the landscape for women's entrepreneurship. The forum, organized by the International Trade Center and Apex Brazil, is designed to help women-owned businesses to grow and expand to new markets, ultimately driving job creation and economic growth. Women own one-third of private businesses and earn only 1% of corporate procurement and government procurement. Women invest most of their income back into their families and their communities. But still we have some major gaps between our vision of equal opportunity for women, because as each of you probably knows, women do 70% of the world's work and yet only earn 10% of the income. In the lead up to the forum, women committed to a call to action to take one million women-owned businesses to market by 2020 through measures including data collection, updated policies, inclusive procurement practices, and access to finance. You are the ones that transform all of this potential into business, into growth, into GDP, and through that into eradication of poverty. There are so many women which were hidden and which are now here in, the, in this uh, beautiful place. In order to have more uh, women entrepreneurs, you have to empower women economically, socially, and you have to have more women in the decision-making arenas. Women reinvest up to 90% of their income in their families and communities, a strong business case to get more women in trade. Susanna Pak, ITC News, Sao Paulo, Brazil.